Okay, our first off item is our 1964 panel truck. The Ford F-Series of trucks was a staple on the farm and the vehicle of choice for commercial work around town. A rugged workhorse and favorite delivery vehicle was the 1960 F-100 panel truck, since its large panel size doubled as a moving billboard. First to check out the panel truck is Rodriguez Rod and Cycle. Man, nice big block. I mean, it'd be neat for somebody, dude. This thing's just a lot of work. I used to have a 59 Ford. There's a reason why I sold it as well. This panel wagon looked like somebody drug it up out the bottom of the ocean. Throw some gravel down that carburetor for the next guy, huh? Rodriguez is not interested. I see a lot of shag carpeting. This was a stabbing cabin here, man. <laughs> Frank's probably conceived one of his children in one of these. It probably brings back good memories. You're right, Holly. This does bring back good memories. Real good memories. Holy cow. That's an FE motor? That's a 429. It's a whole lot of body work. It's all cancer done. You just cover all that with shag garbage. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's not let these guys see that we uh, have any interest in this. Well, this panel truck has old Frank's interest, but he's going to play his cards close to the best. Oh, damn, oh. look at that. This is for air. Dude, the windshield's busted. The quarter glass is busted. Like, this whole thing is rusted. It looks like a money pit. I don't want to even go near it. I might get tetanus. Because the yeah. tires alone are worth probably well, 400 rust, bucks. Though. Sell the motor for a couple hundred bucks and scrap the body for probably 200. Atomic thinks they can make some money gutting this panel truck for parts. So they're going to go for it. Woo! Check this out, guys. This actually is pretty rare. What's up with this door? We've got a really bad rust problem on this door. This panel truck is not a quick flip, but the right person will spend a lot of money on it. It's got potential, uh, yeah. guys. Yeah. What's it going to do? Wave his little magician's hanky and make the rust disappear? Think about Dude, it. We go to what? a local business. We make it their delivery vehicle. I see something special going on here. It could be a really cool build. Who wants their car customized by a mom and pop oil chain service center? I'm starting to feel it. It's we're like going to have a lot of price. work if we're going to pick this one up. Yeah, so we got to pick it up cheap. Barrett Auto is in. Maybe they'll actually get it if they ask Frank nicely. All new Texas Car Wars, next Thursday at 10.